Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel and if you think this look is amazing then keep on watching. It was made with the fake Kylie palette which I'm not gonna lie it's pretty pretty. So let's crack on to the packaging. So as you can see it's the Royal Peach palette by Kylie and it is the fake one. The box came in pretty good condition, apart from this rip here, which I actually did. That was me, so. <laughs> but even the detail on the side, like, it's pretty well detailed. And it's got, like, a sticker, and it's got all of the, um, names here. So, it says Sorbet, Seashell, Peachy, Royal, Queen Bee, Duke, Duchess, Sandy, Mojito, North Star, Crush, and Cinnamon. So, now we'll just open up the palette. Ooh. So, on AliExpress, this wasn't under Kylie Cosmetics, it was under Kylie Star. But, as you can see, it's still clearly Kylie. You can't fake us fakes. Still clearly Kylie. Now, this is, like, kind of textured here. This is matte, and this is glossy, which is I think is a really cool effect. And it is shiny, shiny gold. And, again, a sticker's being chucked on with the same, like, names of each shade. So, it's pretty cool. And it does come with a mirror and the name, and it also comes with this. Let's see. Ah! Comes with this brush that I can't get out. And. Okay, so the bristles are actually pulling out. I'm pulling the bristles out as we speak. But hey, doesn't seem too bad. And it's got Kylie written really crappily on there, but I mean, you can't go wrong with that. You can't go wrong with that, guys. Alrighty, so here are the shades here. So, this must be sorbet. So, I'll just swatch on my hand and see. Oh, it feels very creamy. It is very creamy. So, what I'm going to do is just put my arm here. And just put that there where you can see. You can see that one there. Just move it over a little bit. You can see that there. And I'm just going to get the shade sorbet there. Okay, for a fake, it's actually pretty pigmented. That's quite nice. Right, other finger, I'm going to get seashell. Which, again, a lot of pigment for this fake. So it's gone on quite nicely there. It's still got a little bit of pigment, so I ain't really complaining. And then we'll go with the shade Peachy, which I think is meant to be a bit more peachy than this, but... Damn, look at that pigment! Damn! Oh, wow. Okay, I'm actually really impressed with this so far. This is actually quite nice. So now we're going to go for shade Royal, which is this blue colour here, which is fitting. And it's quite, quite pigmented on there. Oh, my finger, not so much, but there's still a little bit of pigment there. Alright, thumb, and let's get shade Queen Bee, which is this kind of metallic -y brown colour. Just put that down like that. Oh, that's really pretty. That is really, really pretty. I'm just going to clean off my fingers now. And then I'm going to get shade Duke, which is this like a metallic -y pink which I'm so impressed with this pigment this is ridiculous like that's 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 pretty good that's pretty good all right shade Duchess now which is like this metallic -y shade I mean come on I'm not trying to like <laughs> what is this pigment right now it's so good it's so good all right so shade Mojito will be the next one, which is this green metallic. Oh no, hang on, I missed one. So now we're going to go for shade Sandy, which is this shade here, which would be a really good transition shade. As you can see, it's still got some pigment there. Okay, so on my arm, I can't see where I put it. I mean, slightly, but not much. Alright, let's go for shade Mojito. And go here. Alright, so that didn't really pack a punch either. That was quite that was quite piss poor. Mahito, you've let me down. And then if we go North Star, which is this pink colour here. Oh yep, now it's got a little bit to it. Now these aren't actually chalky. They're actually quite kinda what do you call it? Creamy. Quite creamy, yeah. Um and now we'll go with shade Crush, which is this pink colour here. Again, so pigmented. Whoa, that was, it was, it was pretty good. They weren't too bad. They weren't too bad. And now I'm going to go with shade Cinnamon. 
which is this one here. Oh, that's quite pigmented too. That is quite pigmented. So that is them here. I'm just going to retry um, Mojito on a different thing. I'm just going to kind of smush some more on there. See, there's some pigment there. I feel like that's kind of... I mean, kind of redeeming itself a little bit. And we're just going to get that um, sandy colour again. And just give that a go. Because maybe I wasn't pushing hard enough. See, there's, there's some pigment there. See, there we go. There we go. I feel like that's better. It makes me a little bit more happy. But... Shit, that's, that's really, really good. Like, look how pigmented these all are with it. Like, what? And this is a fake? Like, what? <laughs> this is incredible. This is amazing. So I've got the palette here. Now, I don't really know what kind of colors I'm going. I've put, like, a nude lipstick on. Which I think is quite cute. Mannequin by Jeffree Star, in case you're wondering. But, um, I'm actually going to use this brush as well. I'm going to... Mm. I don't know if I talked about the brush before, but the bristles are quite uneven, so I don't think I want to use this, but I'm going to give it a crack. I'm going to bring you closer. So this is shade Sandy. The brush isn't too bad, actually. But I think, so I can blend this quicker, I'm going to use a different one, but that one's actually not too bad. And I think I'm going to use a different one. Now I'm just going to get another brush and just go underneath with the same shade Sandy. Now these are actually really good. Really, really good. Now I'm going to go with shade peachy I'm just going to it's just there's a lot of fallout but I mean it is a fake so I mean like look at that pigment and it's not like super peachy but like you can't deny this color is pigmented as hell I'm just going to get shade Mojito and get a different brush. So I'm just going to get shade Mojito and go underneath my eye here. Yeah. Screen shade. So Mojito doesn't pick up super well, but not as well as Peachy, and it is a little bit metallic-y, but it's not too bad so far. So that is it under there. It's not as bright as I'm wanting, so I'm actually just going to get a shade Royal and use that instead. So it's a bit duller than I was thinking, but it's still really pretty. So now I'm going to go in with shade North Star. So now I'm just going to get in with that Kylie brush. With that Kylie brush and just blend it actually really good for blending this brush so don't be scared at how like wispy and freaky it looks it's not too bad if you do buy this not recommending it though but I mean some of these colors are boom so now I just want to kind of get like a real darker shade and put it on the outer corner so I think I'm going to go with this matte shade. What I've been doing is actually putting metallics with these mattes, so that's why they look a bit strange. But I'm going to go with the shade Cinnamon on the, like, ugh, inner corner. Inner corner. I don't know the shade Cinnamon. So there's like a tiny bit of fallout, so just let me get that too. And that is the kind of jumbled up <laughs> weird strange look there. So I'll just add some 
lashes, well, mascara and some eyeliner, and then bring it back for y'all. So this is the final look here. Using the fake Kylie palette, which, I mean, I actually didn't think was that bad. Like, I quite liked it. it. I mean, my mistake, I think, was using metallic shades with, like, matte shades. It's, I shouldn't have done that. I shouldn't have done that. But, I mean, the colours, probably not the best colours to put together, but I actually am not that mad at it. I'm not that mad at it. I think it's quite cute. So, anyway, hopefully you guys liked that. Now, I know I can't recommend a fake, but this fake was bomb as fuck. So, if you guys want to get one... Not recommending it, but anyway, hope you guys enjoyed that. And if you did, don't be afraid to give me a thumbs up and subscribe wherever the box is. And don't forget, I love you guys so much, and I'll see you on the next one. <sighs> Bye. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. And if you want to see how this makes.